All right, so a short uh, rundown. I got my little snap on light here. I got everything ready. Uh, the grinder, got it ready, got the pad. Uh, got to fill it up, but I got a mulching job to do in the morning. It's only a one day. It's several days, but they said that we'll have to do some here and there. Uh, just got the, as you've seen, I was spinning this filter. It's pretty late tonight. So I'm at my shop, you know, got my 30 foot and then I got the trailer here. I got my shop here. Go ahead and get that. Uh, got everything greased. I'm going to have to get up early in the morning, probably about six o'clock. And uh, get everything, the, the teeth grinded down or sharpened up a little bit. Uh, then checked all the filters, make sure everything was good. <clears throat> so checked the oil, everything's good on it before I started. Even I haven't started this machine up since that last time I done that driveway job. So if I don't have to run it, I ain't gonna run it. So now I think it's like nine o'clock. Let me look. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, so, got everything topped off. <clears throat> so, we should be ready to roll. Uh, one thing I gotta do is fix this latch. Uh, I have to use a bungee cord to hold it. Uh, found out that the metal, why is it strobing in there? Uh, I have no idea. It looks like it's strobing. I think it's a light on my head. I got a headlamp. But uh, anyway, so right in here, it's a sandwich piece. And you can see a little bit where it's not even what's well, rubbing that piece of metal. So I might have to buy a whole new door piece. It won't even shut. So it won't even shut right. That's why I had to zip tie there to help me hold it Let's see if i can get this to hold there but we got a mulching job in the morning thankfully uh i did that other job with the digging and stuff like that was for my best friend's dad he's a real good friend of mine too but hanging out with him this week uh and then doing the digging too so i got everything ready so now turn the lights on the shop see if i can't get on out of here and uh get some food i'm hungry yo so starting a mulching job today uh i haven't uh took me about 15 20 minutes to get where i needed to be I had to back in here, a little tight spot here, going down the road. Pretty, uh, you can kind of see this field right here. I think it was like four or five acres. So we're gonna go ahead and start on the other side. The, the hardest spot is what needs to be done, so. done for uh, cows or something like that. Get down to it, it's pretty rough down through here. All right, so here it is. So the edge shoots back that way. <clears throat> they keep it um, mowed to the edge of the property. I got all this. Uh, it looks like a lot right here, but there's a fence right behind those pines right here. So it's like a like a cross fence whatever it is <clears throat> shoots back for two sides but i'm gonna get in here <clears throat> and get this i'm not really for sure if there's any fencing in here so i'm just kind of gonna hit the edge just so that way i can see let's just go ahead and get started i forgot my tripod uh it's been a while since i recorded didn't have it in the truck uh so i'm gonna try to get some outside footage but one of these briars and little trees grab it knocks it off it's 
these GoPros are like four or five hundred bucks. So, but <clears throat> we're gonna try to get it. See if we can get a better view. Should take too terribly bad, but it looked a lot better. They're wanting to make uh, want to make some uh, property for some cows.
All right. Got to get out, stretch, start around 8, 15, because it took me about 15 minutes to to get down here because it's, uh, it's a back road and it's chert. And it's got a bunch of holes in it, so I drove a little easier. I had stopped because I got a tree right here. It takes you about a few seconds to power down. That way you can get all this. That way it don't cause a couple hundred dollars in damage ripping something out. That I needed a stretch too, so. That's one thing about this motor I do not like. It just packs right here. Then you hear something crunch. You don't know if it's something off the machine or if it sticks. No, that I usually get out every so often to check, make sure nothing's leaking. It's just the inner mechanic in me. So. It looks good, a couple hours. It's uh, nine, almost 10 o'clock, so that much time. Got that much. Push a little further, there's a couch over there and there's like a trench, but I can't get over there in that stuff because there's a bunch of rocks too. There's a fence line right there. So, you gotta dig out some of that garbage. There's a bunch of garbage. There's like 10, 15 trailers down through here. So it's like a dead end. So all the trash goes right here. I'm gonna come in, mulch a little bit, and then see if I can hand pick some of this garbage so it ain't strode into a million pieces. And I think they, she said something, she wanted a, like a barrier from all that, so the trailers so there's another probably acre on the other side but <clears throat> looking pretty good
Ah, oh. been sitting there for hours. Whew. It's looking good. One thing about mulching pine, you get all the pine needles stuck in the radiator. But anyway, look how good that looks. Oh, there's some chunks here in there. I'm gonna go ahead and get it all piled up, stuff pulled off the trees. That's what I'm talking about. Feels good to be back in the machine. Taser looks still looking pretty good. Go ahead and start getting the pile up right here. But this is pretty much it. A little bit of cleaning, a little bit of back dragging. But other than that, the uh, owner come by, so she was pretty happy. So we'll eventually do that down there. Uh, forgot the acreage, but it's a pretty, pretty big amount. Uh, but it's all fenced in, which I seen it coming right in here and it shoots this way. So this is what we got done in a day, eight hours. That's a fence line to, to that. They said they want to leave a, a barrier from the trailer park over there. But that's pretty thick, especially Bradford pears. Got a piece of tin right there I need to clean up. But that is it. So if you liked it, like and subscribe. See you on the next one.